The consumption of fat across Somaliland has drastically reduced since the government imposed a ban on the stimulant drug last month over fears of the spread of COVID-19. Experts had expressed fears that fat will play a huge role in the spread of COVID-19. But smugglers are still trying every possible means to import the drug, which is very popular across Somaliland. When the ban was imposed, there was no specific guideline on the punishment that will be taken against any company or individual that breaks the new law. The main opposition party, Wadani, today said that recent incidents indicate that Somaliland is sliding into a dictatorship. The Secretary General of Wadani Party, Ghadar Hussein, says the police have no authority to take over private property. <laughs> We should not be using the pandemic as a gateway to further intimidations and illegal arrests. We know that vehicles owned by cat traders have been illegally been taken over by the police. The decision was illegal. The constitution doesn't allow such action to be taken. Cat is not categorized as a drug in Somaliland. It has been stopped temporarily because of COVID-19, just like other measures that has been taken by the government. He further added that actions that has been taken by the government in the past can be termed as dictatorial. We have seen many people who have illegally been arrested and many others whose rights have been violated. Since COVID-19 was reported in Somaliland, the government took drastic measures including banning the importation of heart from neighboring Ethiopia. The decision has since been welcomed by experts who argue that this will lower coronavirus infections in the country.